Marin Radio Test Set MRTS-7M is intended to carry out the initial periodical or renewal surveys of MFHF VHF radios with DSC and not text receivers in accordance with IMO resolutions. Here we have this VHF radio station with DSC made by Samyung and we are going to perform some tests with it. And to do this, we connected our tester to the radio station by means of power sensor and cables. Let's make some tests. For example, we are going to perform operation test of emergency channel 60. We go to VHF test menu, then we are going to VHF synthesizer. Here we can adjust the signal we are going to send to station to check the operation. We can select the channel or we can set up frequency manually. Here is the step of the frequency setup. Also we can set up the level of output signal, uh, the step of output signal. Then we can select the modulation type, let it be FM. So, let's check the station now. We hear the signal is receiving the modulated signal from our tester. We can change the tone, but it doesn't matter. The main idea, we have performed the operation test by sending the modulated signal to the station. And it's received. Okay, now we will send the modulated signal from the station and we will receive it by our tester. When receiving the signal, we are capable to measure power level, frequency and frequency deviation of the signal. We select the VHF receiver menu and go to the waiting mode. We should select the proper channel or set the frequency manually. For example, it will be 16 channel, channel again. And now, to start measurements, we should press enter. We use dual tone sounder as a sound source and we turn it on. We hear the sound, then we transfer it by the station and press enter to perform measurements. So we can repeat it, repeat it again and again and we see the measured results. Uh, frequency meaning, uh, power level, and frequency deviation. We performed operational test of emergency channel of this station. Uh, anyway, we can do the same test for any simplex channel. Uh, operation test includes the sending and receiving the signal from the station. Also, we have measured the uh, power level and uh, frequency and frequency deviation. So, I think that's enough for this. Now, let's check the DC channel 70. Let's turn the station to the DC mode by pressing here. So, uh, we are on the 70 channel, and now we can send and receive some DC signals. We have two options we can send uh, a distress call to all ships or individual test call to our station using its MMSI code. Let's check the station is capable to send the distress signal and measure the frequency and power level in, se in channel 70. To do so, we go to receive DC menu and uh, go to the waiting mode. Now we should send the signal, the emergency signal from the station. We will use this red button to set immediate distress signal. Now we hear the station sends the signal. Okay, let's turn it off and check the tester for the results. The tester have received the distress signal from the station. Uh, we see the results. Also, we can check the frequency, uh, deviation, power level. So everything have been measured. Finally, we are going to send the distress signal to our station 
To do so, we go to send this C menu, select the distress signal, then we can input here by this digital keyboard the MMSI code of the station and set up the power level of output signal and press enter. Signal is sent. Now we hear the station received the distress signal. Just to be sure that the station received uh, receiving the signals correctly, we can send the test signal uh, into the station MSI code and sending this uh, message. We hear the station successfully received. We can save the results for further processing and certificate creation. Thank you for the attention.